Welcome to Friday Night Football, Week 5 edition. I'm your host, Matt Locke. We'll hear from Ryan Reynolds in just a moment. District play begins tonight for a few Concho Valley teams. For others, it's the final test before district play. We started off in San Angelo Stadium where the Bobcats open up district play against the undefeated Weatherford Kangaroos. The quarterback battle between Malachi Brown and Ken Seals took center stage tonight. So we head out to San Angelo Stadium for game one in District 3, 6A. The Bobcats ready to go. First quarter, Malachi Brown floats it up for Joseph Kotheka. That's a beautiful touchdown. Central goes up 7-0 early. Next Bobcat possession, Malachi Brown once again floats it to Christian Gabladon for another touchdown. Bobcats led 14-3 at that point. Second quarter, Bobcat offense keeps it going, and Malachi keeps it, keeps it going. Forced outside of the pocket, and he's going to take off, showing off his legs. He had two touchdowns last year against Weatherford. He adds one there. Central leads 21-3. Central homecoming fans loving it. Still not done in the first half. Malachi Brown is going to find his good friend Tanner Dabbert on the easy screen pass, fights off the face mask, stays on his feet, dives for the end zone. The touchdown stands. Central led 31 to 10 at the half. Weatherford made it a ball game, but Central hangs on to win it 45 to 38 in their homecoming game. This is where Ryan Reynolds comes in because he's out at San Angelo Stadium to wrap it all up. Ryan, what have you got for us? Matt, just a roller coaster game here at San Angelo Stadium. Like you said, the Bobcats, they pick up the win 45 38. I'm joined now by Central Head Coach Brent Davis. Coach, that game probably closer than what it should have been. You guys led 31 10 at the half. Uh, they came out in the second, and you guys allowed 21 unanswered. What kind of happened there? Well, I mean, we just, that's a good football team. I mean, we knew they were going to come out in the second half and have a plan. You know, their quarterback's a D1 guy going to Vanderbilt, running backs as good as we've seen. And, you know, you, uh, they were going to get some plays. There wasn't no be any doubt about that. We just we didn't answer them in the third quarter, which we had a chance to, and we kind of made some uh, mistakes on our own that kept us from finishing drives. But it is a great football game. That's a that's a great team, and uh, I thought we grew up a lot tonight. You guys have Euless Trinity on the road next week. What can you tell us about them? Good, you know, good football team. This whole district is. Uh, they're big. Uh, they run power football. We got to go to Pennington Field and play them next Friday, and uh, you know we'll be ready. The Central Bobcats opening District 36A with a win. Reporting live here from San Angelo Stadium. One last time, the Bobcats they win their homecoming game, 45-38. Matt, back to you in the studio.